Good morning, guys. Welcome back. Um, my name is Nina, in case you are new to our channel. Um, today, Boyce is at work, and I actually have a day off, so I'm trying to record some content. <laughs> so, um, like I said, good morning. I have my coffee here, and um, we're going to do unboxing of the True Leaf Fall Grab Bags. My husband was very sweet enough to buy me one. If you are interested, it is still live. As you can see, um, according to this, that it'll be there until it's all gone. Until, you know, there's just no mass. And before we get into um, the uh, unboxing, um, I just wanted to ask you all to please send up some prayers over to um, Triple Threat Firearms and Defense for Miss Tarsha. I know that she's been going through some difficulties. Also, Andrea and her husband, Mr. Mike at Digging for Health, and also Indiana Backyard Gardener. They've all been going through some stuff. Um, so just keep them in your thoughts and your prayers and just go by and watch some of their content and just uplift them with your kind words. If you're not the praying type, um, uplift them with your kind words and your good vibes and just give them words of encouragement and just surround them with y'all's love. Okay. All right. So let's get into this. I am so excited. Alrighty, here we go. It comes in this nice, my goodness. Sorry about that. <laughs> what a morning. Okay, so uh, it comes in this a sustainable resealable package. It says right there. This is what it looks like. This is the back of it. And if y'all are interested, I will leave a link down below where you can find True Leaf, um, True Leaf uh, seeds. This is where we buy our microgreens mostly from. Well, no, not mostly. It's all of them. We buy all of our, and we have great germination throughout. So here it is. Woo! So excited. Let's see what kind of stuff we get in here. All right. So, I know Andrea from Digging From Health got one of these. Um, grab bag, sorry, excuse me. My eye is itchy. And also, Miss Nicole Smith from Nicole Smith Gardening. She also got one. She's also my new neighbor and my new friend. Just, you know, name dropping a little. Anyways, so, um, True Leaf doesn't have, like, the pictures on the front. So, um, they just have these sort of, um, packages. So, uh, this one is Black Beauty Zucchini. Um, this is Radish French Breakfast. Oh, I got two radish French breakfast. Uh, corn, original eight row golden bantam. Uh, organic large cherry red tomatoes. Boys loves growing tomatoes. That's his thing. <laughs> Vegetable spaghetti squash. Interesting. I have not done squash um, or like zucchini or anything like that. Red Russian kale. That'll be great for this fall. Um, thyme. That's great. Some herbs. Yay. Another thyme. Purple cone flower. That is one of my goals for next year is to grow more flowers. 
and another one, purple cone flower. Wow, I got a lot of doubles. Uh, Black Beauty Eggplant. We have grown eggplant and it's so much fun and it's so beautiful. The flowers are just lovely. They're just gorgeous. Um, this one does have the picture in it. Eggplant, bleh, eggplant Hybrid Japanese. Nashubi Millionaire. I like the, the way the packet it looks. It's, it looks all antique-ish. This one as well, Sorrel Red Veined. This will also be good for the fall. Let's see what else. What else? Um, celery Utah 52-70 Tall Improved. Toe Kale, hopefully. I think this is the Dinosaur Kale. Yep. Dinosaur Kale. I hope I didn't butcher that name. I'm really bad at doing that. Another Kale. Organic Waltham 29 Broccoli. Ooh. This is something that I haven't thought about putting in my garden for this, for this fall garden. Small Sugar Pumpkin. Another uh, Walton 29 Broccoli. It says Organic. I feel like I have Pokemon cards. <laughs> um, Black Beauty Zucchini. Organic. Charleston Wakefield Cabbage. Watermelon Sugar Baby. Little Finger Carrots. Yeah, our carrots that we grew. Yeah. This is this is good that I got these. Oh, by the way, if anybody wants some of my extra seeds, hit me up. <laughs> and we could do like a seed swap. Or if you just need seeds, I'm more than happy to help you out. All right, this is the last of them. Organic large cherry tomatoes. Another one. I think I got a lot of doubles compared to my other friends. Organic chives. Crimson sweet watermelon. This is gonna be fun to grow. I have another watermelon. If I'm not mistaken, it's a sangria watermelon that MB Heritage um, suggested and we bought some, but we didn't get to grow them. But that's something to look forward to. Another crism, crimson sweet watermelon. Lettuce romaine, Paris Island. It says organic. Another lettuce romaine, Paris. I think I got the bottom end of the seeds. Like, yeah. Anyways, seeds are seeds and I love seeds. Hello, my name is Nina and I am a seed hoarder alcoholic not an alcoholic acetaholic <laughs> straight eight cucumbers boys loves cucumbers i'm so excited another one straight eight broccoli sprouting green cow breeze i got two of those i gotta look some of these up because i have not heard of some of these swiss chard ruby red i do have a few swiss chards i gotta do a fall garden update well i haven't even yeah i've been dropping the ball and so busy and so much has been going on another swiss chard ruby red but i will get back with you guys on that um fall update that i have not done my bad please forgive Okay, purple uh, cone flower. Yeah, cone flower. Corn, eight row, another one. I, I got a lot of doubles. I'm not mad at it because I'm pretty sure I can um, give some of these to somebody and it'll be helpful for them if they're willing, if they're wanting to start an, a garden. I'm always an encourager of somebody doing garden stuff because it's fun and it's relaxing and 
it feeds you and it's organic and better for you than the stuff at the store. I didn't say that. Okay, lettuce romaine, another one, and red Russian kale. I'm excited because some of these I am going to put into something. I'm going to plant. I'm going to put them into something. Um, boys and I are working on getting our other beds together. Um, I'm not sure how long that's going to take. I'm hoping this fall it'll all come together. At least a few of them will be up, our raised garden beds. Uh, just money, time, and the resources is always a factor for us. But anyways, um, that's it. That's all I have for you today. Don't forget to check out True Leaf. And don't forget to visit our friends that I mentioned earlier. Give them love and encouragement and just give them prayers and let them know that you are there for them. And we are a community. And even though we don't know one another, like one to one, I like to think that we are all connected in one shape or form. All right, guys. Um, before I get on this soapbox, <laughs> um, this is all for today. I wish you all a blessed day and don't forget to like, subscribe and share with the world, share with your friends, share with anybody that's into planting or doesn't even like planting, but talks about planting probably. And, um, yeah, that's all for today. Okay guys. Bye.